Dr. Mahathir Mohamad has denied the claims made by former Attorney General Tommy Thomas that he had lobbied to become interim Prime Minister following his resignation in February last year. The denial came after Thomas wrote in his book that Yang Di Pertuan Agong, Sultan Abdullah Sultan Ahmad Shah proposed Mahathir's deputy, Dr. Wan Aziza Wan Ismail, as interim Prime Minister after Mahathir tendered his resignation. In a lengthy blog post published this evening, Mahathir said Thomas knew nothing about the resignation. However, Mahathir wrote, Thomas told him that the Agong had wanted to appoint Wan Aziza as interim Prime Minister. Mahathir called this nonsense. He added that after reluctantly accepting my resignation, the Agong suggested I become interim Prime Minister. He explained that Wan Aziza could not be acting Prime Minister or interim Prime Minister because the Pakatan Harapan government had already collapsed. Thomas's memoir, My Story, Justice in the Wilderness, was published last Saturday. In the memoir, Thomas also wrote that Mahathir had wanted him to resign immediately after telling him the Yang Dipertuan Agong had assented to his appointment due to Malay backlash over the appointment. Nevertheless, he managed to hold on to his new job for 20 months, thanks in part to support from PAS that day. However, things later soured and PAS began demanding Thomas's removal.